Hey y'all, what's up, my beautiful peeps? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Gifted Since 92, giving you guys the latest and exclusive content on new music, entertainment news, and inspirational quotes by me, your truly Queen's back. All right, so my girl Citizen Queen released their uh, debut EP. It's called The Click. Um, there are 10 tracks, and I'm going to do an honest review of their new project. Um, my favorite standout tracks and overall how I feel about the entire EP. So let's get it popping as always, shall we? All right. So number one, Hold Up Baby. Number two, So Special. Number three, Replay. Number four, Click Interlude. Number five, What You Want. Number six, Waste My Time. Number seven, FYP, Burn the Book, Frank the Seas. Number eight, Breakup. Number 10, Happy Peel. Number 10, XO. My favorite soundtracks are Hold Up Baby, So Special, What You Want, Waste My Time, Break Up, Happy Peel, and XO. They are it for themselves, period. I love this EP. And what I love about them as a group is, and I've been promoting them on this channel, um, I feel like their sound sonically brings a lot of those really nice elements of R&B, pop, hip hop, soul music, but with that nostalgia. And I love that they're that versatile. And this EP, I feel like that nostalgia of how all these young women, they can sing, they can rap. I love the rapping, the bars. Um, and I feel like as I was listening to the Click EP, kind of brought me back, like how when I was pretty much in school, how like, you know, new girl groups are like emerging, you know, and, you know, for my generation. And that whole thing about how girl groups don't exist, no. These talented young women are very beautiful. Um, they're a mix, like a, like a diverse girl group, which like, it's really amazing and dope. And what I love about their sound, the production, really, you can hear like the melody, you can hear the harmony, you can hear the really nice layered, the sound, their sound is more of like that euphoria. And it brings back a little bit of like the early 2000s era of like R&B pop soul music. And you can hear like a little bit of 90s music. And their sound, I also um, recognize that they have like that futuristic army soul sound as well. And it works very well for them. Um, they're singing. Um, you can hear their vocals. Um, they have more like that sultry, um, more of like that. The range that they have is more of like sultry, um, charisma, and personality. But you can hear their vocals throughout the um, entire EP. And this is why I feel like for Citizen Queen, they pretty much are on their way. You know, they have been doing their thing. They are, they are on their way. They've been doing their thing. Because to me, I feel like Citizen Queen, for them to be that talented and for them to have a sound that's very unique. And also, I love that how there's like up-tempo records. There's like dance records. There's like female empowerment records. There's like sexy records. There's like, like love romance records. And really for them, it's kind of like, yeah, that's how girl groups are supposed to be for themselves. The songwriting, and this is why I know about the songwriting. The songwriting is very, very, really well put together. It's dope. And really, I really like the fact that Sis and Queen, you know, really have so much of that enigma and the chemistry. It's like out of this world. And I feel like for them, they're going to be pretty much, like I said, I look forward to seeing them really, really, you know, like expand, you know, with their music careers. I really see them like as like a really, you know, for themselves, you know, Citizen Queen as the next Citizen Queen for like, yeah, because really listening to like girl groups, like even like the pop songs, the pop songs, I wouldn't even put them in category just pop because the elements of their sound has a little bit of everything. And, you know, it's really, really, really um, just awesome. And I feel like this is the reason why it pretty much it takes, like I said, 
you know, it takes a while for girl groups to really manifest and find their lane and their sound. So overall, I feel like I am pretty much, like I said, I got to hear and feel uh, the Click EP. I love the art cover. It takes me back to like that composition book, you know, school days. Um, and, you know, more like that really nice nostalgia to it with a twist. So my queens, they did their thing. Awesome. I'm going to give um, the Click EP a five out of five. Art covers is beautiful, hands down. So that being said, um, guys, sis and queen fans, share your thoughts and opinions. Stay tuned on the next episode of Get Since Night 2. Like, share, comment, subscribe down below. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification button. And as always, stay tuned on the next episode of Get Since Night 2, Dragon Ball Z narrative reference. Peace, bye-bye. Girls, as and out. The Super Saiyan's out.